Welcome to Evo Studios. Well, we're not exactly in Evo Studios, obviously. We are at Standard TV and Appliance in Bend, Oregon. We have bootlegged their kitchen studio. And the reason being is today I want to drive home two things. One, I want to show you how to use the Evo apps object recognition software and tracking in combination with Evo compatible gimbals, as well drive home a use case scenario on where you can use the object tracking software in a real world scenario. And that being one of my favorites is the vlogger blogger kind of kitchen show sort of setup. So I got my buddy Flora in the background doing like a mock cooking show and we're going to use her as a kind of our model. It's important to understand first off how object recognition works, okay, the, the actual technology, all right? It is not a magic wand, okay? So there's a few things that you want to do to ensure its success. First off, you want to make sure there's good lighting on your subject, okay? So we got good lighting on Flora. You want to make sure that your subject is wearing a very plain colored outfit. Now, why is that? Object recognition works on pixel tracking, okay? So it's actually tracking pixels. So Flora is wearing a very simple blue solid blouse. You don't want to track people's faces because there's too many contours and too many changes with the hair and the face and the lips moving that the software will, will lose track of those pixels. So we're going to use Flora's basic blue blouse. Also, there's a contrast between the background and her blue blouse. You don't want the, the object that's going to be being tracked to be the same as the background. It'll be too confusing. So try to make sure there's a different white background, black shirt. Okay, next up, uh, if you haven't downloaded the Evo app, go ahead and download it because you'll obviously need it. And I'm going to turn on my Evo app, make sure that your Bluetooth is on. I actually have the motors in my SP Pro turned off right now and uh, the Bluetooth is turned on. I'm going to go to connect my device. Uh, you can see there's the Evo SP Pro. It's going to grab it and we are now ready to go. Now of course I'm in kind of this selfie mode right here and I'm going to actually turn the motors on of my app and uh, frame up my subject. Looks good. Once your phone has flipped to landscape mode, and that's important, make sure that the app has flipped into landscape mode because that's the only way that this will actually uh, be functional. In the bottom left hand corner, you'll notice there's a little circular target. You want to tap it and it'll turn red. You are now in this object tracking mode. So. You want to give it a lot of pixels to look for, all right? Now, the, the blue blouse, as we've explained, is very important, but you don't want to actually make a rectangle so small that it's just on her blouse. We, we recommend almost sort of a, a full body rectangle that you can touch the screen, drag, draw it over to the top of her head, all the way down across her shoulders and down to her waist, almost to the tabletop. So you give um, a large group of pixels to be, to, to be tracked. At this point, we're ready to start the cooking show and I'll hit record and Flora's ready to go. So, at the beginning, she might be playing around with some vegetables, looking at her spices, um, you know, giving people instruction, uh, but at this, you know, maybe she needs to get something out of the oven. So, if she needs to get something out of the oven, She'll do her best to move slowly. You don't want to make any abrupt movements. You know, like I said, it's tracking pixels. So, um, you know, Flora, maybe go grab something out of the oven. She'll cruise on down there. And of course, in a real cooking show, it won't be me monologuing. It'll be, you know, Flora, you know, talking about whatever it is that she's making. Um, so keep in mind, keeping your movement smooth is very important. Give yourself uh, very easy pixels to track. Uh, again, the blue blouse, but also, you know, drag a, a big triangle of pixels from her head down to her waist. And uh, you're going to be good to go and you're just pretty soon you're going to be a super famous self-producing cooking show vlogger blogger, right? <laughs>Welcome to my cooking show, The Spirit of Buffet. I'm Flora. So today I'm showing you guys some tips of ancient food. Okay, so one of my favorite here is to use some 
plastic apples with some plastic asparagus and uh, and another important thing is uh, the garlic sauce and put them together marinate with some cooking wine those plastic stuff and the oh forget the lemon any dishes you need a lemon okay so we are ready here <laughs> let me check my plastic turkey if it's ready Oops, need a few more minutes. Remember, this is ancient Chinese secret. Thanks for visiting Evo Studios, and uh, we hope this little use case scenario and little technology uh, educational piece helped you out and uh, has motivated you to go out and do something original and as always we remind you to keep it smooth my friends keep it smooth <laughs>